Peplink routers allow users to block domains from predefined web applications, categories of content, or custom domains. We'll show you how to configure these settings in this video. Start by logging into the router's web admin page. Navigate to the Advanced tab and then select Content Blocking on the left. First, we have the Application Blocking section. Click here and we're given a drop-down list of available applications to select. Click the plus sign to the right to add multiple selections. Under Web Blocking are some preset categories. You can select between High, Moderate, Low, and lastly, Custom. This is where you can select any categories you prefer. Below this, we have a section for customized domains. I'm going to fill in our website here and click the plus sign. I can enter additional domains by repeating this process. I can also use a wildcard asterisk in case I want to cover more than just the .com address. For example, if we had a .co.uk or .org address, these would also be blocked. If any domains should be exempt from these web blocking rules, enter them here as needed and click the plus sign. The last two sections are for networks or submits that should be exempt from all these rules. You can set per user group or specific submits. When done, click save at the bottom of the page, then apply changes at the top right. Now let's try opening a web page to 5gstore.com and see if our blocking rule is working. Okay, there is our failed connection to the site, but let's try a different page just to make sure our internet connection is working. There we go. That's all there is to content blocking on your peplink. We hope you enjoyed this video and welcome you to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this.